In the small town of Point Pleasant, West Virginia, a tale emerged that would become one of America's most haunting legends. Over the span of a year, multiple witnesses reported sightings of a winged creature, its glowing red eyes burning an image into local lore. This being, soon to be dubbed the Mothman, was not just a fleeting apparition. It seemed to carry with it a forewarning of impending doom. A night like no other, it all began on a chilly November night in 1966. Two young couples driving past the town's old TNT plant were met with a sight they could hardly believe. A creature, with wings spread wide and eyes that shone like crimson lanterns, took flight, following their car as they sped away in terror. More sightings and strange phenomena, but this was no isolated event. Over the subsequent months, more and more townsfolk came forward. They spoke of chilling encounters, not only with the Mothman, but also of bizarre occurrences. TVs that spontaneously malfunctioned, phones that rang with unearthly static, and an overwhelming feeling of being watched. A lingering specter. Descriptions of the Mothman varied, but certain features remained consistent. A humanoid figure standing nearly seven feet tall, wings that spanned ten feet, and those unsettling, luminescent eyes. But what did it want? Was it merely observing, or was there something more sinister at play? Men in black. Adding to the unease, strangers dressed in black suits began appearing around Point Pleasant. These so-called men in black would question locals about their encounters, leaving them with more questions than answers. Who were they? And why were they so interested in this otherworldly being? Cryptid or something more? Cryptid enthusiasts speculated that the Mothman might be an undiscovered species, perhaps a giant owl or mutated bird. However, the creature's seeming intelligence and its uncanny ability to evoke deep-seated fear suggested that it might be more than just an animal. Connecting the dots. As reports of the Mothman increased, so did stories of uncanny premonitions. Dreams of water, drowned voices, and collapsing structures haunted the residents. Was the Mothman, as some proposed, a harbinger of tragedy? The Silver Bridge Collapse The tragic answer came in December 1967. The Silver Bridge, connecting Point Pleasant to Ohio, tragically collapsed during rush hour. Forty-six lives were lost. Suddenly, those haunting premonitions seemed less like random nightmares and more like prophetic warnings. The Mothman's Disappearance in the wake of the tragedy, sightings of the Mothman dwindled and eventually stopped. Was its mission fulfilled with the bridge's fall? Did it retreat, its message delivered, or did it merely shift its gaze to a new location, a new warning to deliver? Legacy and Theories Today, the Mothman remains an enigma. Some see it as a malevolent force, while others believe it was trying in its own way to warn the townspeople. Theories range from the extraterrestrial to the spiritual, and from scientific explanations to the realm of pure legend. The legend of the Mothman transcends the boundaries of Point Pleasant, capturing the imaginations of people worldwide. Its legacy serves as a chilling reminder of the thin line between the known and unknown. Whether West Virginia's winged watcher was a warning, a guardian, or merely a figment of collective anxiety, one thing remains certain— the Mothman's tale is an enduring testament to the mysteries that persist in the shadows of our understanding.